Think you're going to like this story. A local Girl Scout is receiving the organization's top award after building sensory panels from scratch, all for special needs children. It sounds like a such sweet story. Earlier today, 6 News anchor Adriana Alexander met the teen and learned why doing something like this was so important to her. Adriana, tell us all about it. Well, this gold award will take Kaylin Pickett to the highest level of accomplishment as a Girl Scout, but what her project does for special needs kids in our area means so much more. She started these with cadets. 15 year old Lake Belton High School student Kaylin Pickett has earned dozens of Girl Scout badges over the last 10 years. As a Girl Scout, she knows a whole lot about helping the community, but a family member inspired her to take her advocacy a step further. I have an autistic co cousin. His name is Rice. He lives in North Carolina. So she went to the Belton Early Childhood Education School to learn how she could help other special needs kids. I had her explore the needs, what her cousin would need, and she would thought, well, a sensory wall. So I said, oh, we would love that idea. With the help of the school and finding items at Goodwill, Pickett built a sensory wall in less than a week. Just to help um, the kids with touch, sense, the five senses, and give them a little place to go out, but still incorporate little learning skills into it. <laughs> it's only been up for a short while. And the kids are already drawn to the area. I had a child come for his first day on Monday. Um, he is in a wheelchair and he was able to roll up to the board and just start playing. Um, if we hadn't had this board, he would have been watching the other kids play on the playground and swinging. Yay! Because of her project, Pickett will be receiving the gold award. It's the highest achievement a Girl Scout can earn. It's awesome to know that I've helped made an impact on someone else's life. Now Pickett will be presented her golden award at a Girl Scout ceremony in Austin later this year, guys. Hopefully I'll be able to attend because that's just such a great thing she did. Absolutely, an exciting, amazing accomplishment and really rare, so yes, she did it. and benefiting Central Texas all at the same time. What a great story. Thank yep. you so much, Adriana.